weren't some of the churches and Christians in Germany behind Hitler, yeah. thinking that he yes. was going to be a, a going to somehow uh, you know rescue Germany from uh, an economic uh, you know depression and, and other sorts of things? It, Germany in the 1930s was in deep economic strife. They had reparations leveled at them from the Treaty of Versailles. They got blamed for the First World War and had to pay reparations. So they were uh, they 40 were broke. Yeah, uh, more than broke. They were deep <laughs> billions of dollars in debt, if I can use the word dollars. 40% uh, unemployment, uh, uh, runaway inflation. So they were looking for a savior, one man who would save them. So Hitler stepped up the plate. When we look back through the swastika, we see instant evil. We see Hitler making speeches, instant evil, but then his speeches were, um, you, if you watch him, go to YouTube, watch Hitler making a speech, you think, what a raving fanatic. But if you watch the English translation, he was saying glorious things to the German people. I'll give you back your dignity. I'll bring glory, but I'll bring in full employment. That's why they were raving and cheering. And that swastika was so a sign was of hope. he was promising them hope. Absolutely. And he was saying he was going to turn things around. But what, what they didn't realize is uh, the way he was going to do it, what his true agenda was. He wanted to take over the world. He wanted to get rid of the Jews. He wanted to kill the Jews. Oh, it, it's just chill, chilling to me because I, I think of, I mean, if, I, you got to be careful, but I mean, I think of our country right now. We're not billions of dollars in debt. We're trillions of dollars in debt. We're yes. 15, 16 trillion dollars yes. in debt. And we want to turn things around. We're looking and, for and a you got to be careful because this is the sort of the conditions that could provide the platform for someone to step up like that and say, I'll give you back your dignity, I'll give you back your this and your that.